Hi, I'm Jonathan Goldberg with HopNews.com and today we're in the middle school auditorium for the new play coming out. So I'm here with Miss Gifford and um, we're going to talk about the play. So first question, what is the name of the play? The name of the play is, appropriately, it all starts here because what else? Hopkinton is so famous for that, we couldn't help but name it that. That's great. So our, this this play is written by you, correct? Myself and also the students. They contributed quite a lot to this actually and we really wanted them to have the experience of really writing their own show. We conceptualized it together. Um, a lot of it was uh, taking inspiration from things like Immigration Day at Hopkins and Colonial Day and all of this and then we decided that uh, as we were evolving I noticed that the students themselves had wonderful stories of their own about their own immigration to Hopkinton because a lot of them are not from here and some of them are as far away as you know Ireland and Europe and other places and some of them just from a town away and they shared their stories at auditions and they were so beautiful some of them that we uh, decided to incorporate those into the show so you'll see a real blend of um, all of that and that's how it evolved so it was me but it was also a lot of the students that's great um, is there any lead characters there are several. The whole story really is about a fictional child um, who is a teenager, angsty, angry teenager, who moves into Hopkinton with his single mom on the eve of the 2015 marathon. And he has an attitude and he doesn't want to be here. And then over the course of the next 24 hours, uh, he meets some kids from Hopkinton and learns a little bit about the town. And then the next morning, um, it's the morning of the, of the actual race, um, he learns a little bit more about the actual people. First first uh, act is all history, the second one is contemporary Hopkinton and you'll see characters like Officer Phil Powers and you'll see some of our teachers, Deb Pinto, Miss Stuckels, uh, Miss Mercier who do Desire to Inspire. You'll see of course our Hopkinton School Administration, Mr. Keller and Mrs. Grady who both do Hopkinton Marathon stuff and also uh, Miss Ben Benick, our Vice Principal and you'll see lots of different kinds of characters. In the end um, this kid realizes that Hopkinton is not such a bad place after all and as the race begins, he embraces that as, at his, as his home and runs off together with everybody else. And the question we're dying here, when will it be out? The show goes up Friday, December 4th and Saturday, December 5th at 7 p.m. in the HMS Auditorium and tickets are on sale all week at the end of rehearsals which is around like 6, 6.30 this week if you want to get your tickets in advance and we hope that everybody can come down and join us for what we hope is going to be a really very different but also very wonderful show. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. Come, come see our show.